Do you know that what you eat makes a significant impact on the environment? Well, some Stanford researchers found out how much and how just a few simple changes are not only healthy for your body, but for the environment as well. So Anna, how big of a problem is it in terms of our diets and how that affects the environment? What we eat is a big percentage of carbon emissions that the U.S. produces. It's about one-fifth or 20% of all carbon emissions come from food production. And the good news is that means that the decisions we make about what foods to eat can have an impact. So what did you find? Specifically, we found that replacing red meat like beef and pork with chicken or vegetarian options and entrees can make a big difference. So for example, if you're ordering a burrito or a burger, choosing to have chicken or beans, like a black bean burger, is much less environmentally damaging than having the beef or pork in that situation. Another option that might be more surprising to consumers is replacing juice with whole fruit. So when you make juice, you have to concentrate the fruit. So you need many oranges to make a cup of orange juice. And that means that we're using more resources per calorie to have the juice than to have the whole fruit. And this is also a change that is good for our health because whole fruit has more fiber and nutrients typically than a glass of juice. What about plant-based foods? Plant-based foods in general tend to have lower environmental impact. We see that with beef, so switching from beef to plant-based protein, as well as with dairy products. So think of your cow's milk. If you can swap that you know, just once a day for soy milk or almond milk, that can reduce your climate impact and improve your dietary quality. Those changes could counteract ailments such as cardiovascular issues, diabetes. This overall measure of the healthfulness of your diet predicts things like whether you'll get heart disease, whether you'll get type 2 diabetes, and even how early you die. So these small changes can help improve your diet without asking you to overhaul everything that you're eating. So you can have your cake and eat it too sometimes. Exactly. <laughs>